Hello, good people. Welcome to Mzansi Scoop, where we give you the latest juicy scoop in just a click. While you're at it, please don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for the latest, freshest news as soon as we drop. Banyana must receive an equal pay as Bafana Bafana, why not? These were the words of Coach Pizzo during an interview with Kaya FM about a week ago. Coach Pizzo put out a challenge for Safa to pay Banyana Banyana the same amount they pay their male counterparts. He didn't stop there but went on to explain that in the United States, they pay the female US squad the same amount they pay their male squad. Now, this is progress, but unfortunately we have Danny Jordan at the helm of Safa since when, well, the beginning of time I guess. And that's where decisions like this must be taken, but we all know nothing ever happens there. If we are talking performance then, most people will agree that the female should be receiving double what is paid to Bafana. It didn't end there. He went on to also challenge companies who are selling women products to get on board and support Banyana Banyana. Well, if companies like Revlon happen to see this video, would you please sponsor their salaries? About a week ago, I made a video where I was given an update on Coach Pizzo's next career move. Well, here's another update. Coach Pizzo announced on that interview that he's taking a break to be with his family and to also launch his new project that is the Pizzo Musimane Soccer Schools. This project, according to him, will be focusing on unearthing new talent, the same way Joe Masona gave him a shot at football. He however clarified that he will indeed go back to coaching, with this being simply a break as many other great coaches have been seen doing the same in the past. He made an example of Pep Guardiola for having done the same. Well, let us watch this space for any developments and from us here at Mzansi Scoop, we say Gorula.